Uh, go on, what else have people been talking about the last year of Rob's team? Um, is it Kim Kardashian's robbery? That was quite a big news story, Huge wasn't it? news, yeah. I mean, she, an armed robbery, I believe. Yeah, and, and it was ridiculous. Her ring was 3.5 million. Yeah, but she tweeted that she had it. I mean, you know... Yeah, I've tweeted, I've got a kid. I don't want someone nicking it. Yeah. <laughs> I think she was foolish. I think it doesn't happen in a travel lodge, does it? <laughs> I'll tell you what, I bet Halifax are fuming they chucked in travel insurance with our advance account. <laughs> <laughs> well, I feel a bit bad for her. She does get kind of hassled the whole time. Take a look at this footage, just days before the robbery in France, and one of Kim Kardashian's fans got a little bit too close. Kim! 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 Oh, my God. I mean, that's... Why does that person not grab him by the neck and go, you stupid piece of shit, don't ever stick a face of a woman you don't know's ass? <laughs> I think he probably does, actually. He looks like he's about to. Why do you feel there's a subway to cross the road? <laughs> I can't tell now I'm going into a tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you that Kim Kardashian being robbed is not one of the most talked about stories of the last year. Those Kardashians have had no luck. They're still reeling from the time Bruce Jenner had his family jewels snatched. <laughs> OK, fingers on buzzers. What else were people talking about this year? Go on, what do you got? It's got to be the old Donald Trump, the uh, president of America, or president-elect. I feel sorry for Donalds. Just Donalds in the world. <laughs> Just a normal man called Donald now. Is, it's going to be the new Adolf. <laughs> I like that you think that it was the Adolfs in the 1930s that really had it hard. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so, so Clinton versus Trump. I mean, it was quite depressing. Did you stay up and watch it? Did you stay up and watch the election? Who stayed up? Well, I don't even stay up for WrestleMania yeah. anymore. Oh, <laughs> Trump wasn't wrestling. He wasn't wrestling. Trump. Trump wasn't wrestling. Trump wasn't WWE, bruv. How can your president been body slammed? Your president have been stone cold stunned. <laughs> He's just not qualified for the job, is he? It's the most important job in the world. He's not qualified for it. But he, he's, he must be so stressed about it. Like, when I worked in an office, I'd panic if they made me change the tone on the photocopier. Like, <laughs> he's got to go and do world things. <laughs> He's, he's, not, he's not the least qualified person for the job, Rob. That's clearly you. Oh. He's got, got, I've got to do world things now. You can sort of imagine him saying that, though. You yeah. can imagine him saying, I've got to do world things. What do you make of him? If I'm honest, He's obviously terrifying, but it's the little one that really worries me. The little son, Baron Trump. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> just standing next to him, just... And you can see that he's plotting, and I am going to put money on him being the supreme leader of the world by 2030. <laughs> so, you think the world's still going to be here in 2030? You're more yeah. optimistic than I am. <laughs> well, some people were thrilled that Donald Trump uh, uh, was coming to power. Take a look at how excited this nine-year-old girl is. Guess what we're going to do Monday? What? We are going to see Donald Trump in person in New Hampshire. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, my word! Are you excited? Yes! You get to go see him in person. Oh. Not just on TV. Thank you, Paul. Oh! <laughs> are you excited? Yes! Do you want to meet him? <laughs> Tell Mr. Trump you want to meet him. Have you ever mixed up uh, Donald Trump and Frozen on Ice? <laughs> I think she has. <laughs> Look, do, you know what, do you know what really depresses me is that following at POTUS, which is the word for President of the United States on Twitter, is so lovely and life-affirming, because Obama's been running the Twitter. So now Donald Trump is going to take over the Twitter account. Can you imagine, like, the tweets are going to go from just had a really positive meeting with Iran to, I think Miss Southern California is a whore. Hashtag whore. Hashtag women are whores. It's just... <laughs> and then Melania Trump is going to be taking over Michelle Obama's one, but then it, she'll just copy and paste all her old tweets. <laughs> uh, it is... It's Melania who I worry about. Because mm. she... <laughs> she must be looking at the Oval Office going, another room that I've got to pretend to come in. <laughs> <laughs> 